Kyle McCord slinging it out, a screen. Couple of blockers. Spring and Garrett Wilson. Wilson with a stick ball. All the way down into the red zone. Cord to Wilson. Well, this is something that Akron struggled with against Temple. Perimeter plays on the outside. All right, Mike, all even there. Buckeyes looking for three concerns. What a talented combination they had there in Philly. Underneath this time, it's Jackson Smith and Jigba. Throw here to the sideline, complete to Garrett Wilson. And missed, I believe, 10 days of practice. Oh! Here's a throw, complete! Touchdown! Jackson Smith and Jigba! It's not just a burst, it's a burst with some serious explosion. Yeah, he reminds me a lot of myself. That's caught, <laughs> shut down. Good throw there by McCord. Yeah, you see Kyle McCord getting settled. He knew where he wanted to go with the football the entire time. Before the third quarter by the alumni marching band, so stay tuned for that at the end of halftime as that pass is complete. Eight Oregon out of high school, Jalen Kelly Powell. Eight yard loss, second and 18. They'd already 285 yards of offense. McCord. He's going to air this thing out, and it's caught. It's Wilson. Coaxed back by an Ohio State staff member before deciding he didn't want to play after all, went to the sideline and threw his gloves into the stands. And now here's Emeka Abuka inside the five and shut down at the two. On the pass from Kyle McCord. Well, that feels a little better for Kyle McCord, doesn't it? After <laughs> that last drive. Abuka, the number one wide receiver in this year's class. Third down at 17. And Jackson Smith and Jigba still with some work to do. Done much wrong, although they do have three holding calls in this quarter. Keeping it here. Dante Demas and Jayshon Jones have to leave the game today on the second play. Half the season after the bye. Record underneath. Abuka, first down, he is met and dropped. It's on ESPN2, the Saints and Seahawks doing battle. Kyle McCord is in the game at quarterback and dumps it off here to Pryor, and he's loose in the secondary. An interception on the season. He'll throw it here, and that pass on target to Marvin Harrison Jr. Syracuse. Run pass option. You see the offensive line's blocking run. It's a quality read there by Kyle McCord. Gets that ball out quick. Football team, and they were in week two. Here's McCord, and he dumps it off. And we're back ever in the Big Ten to have three straight games of, of five touchdowns. There's Marvin Harrison Jr. It's just nice ride there. Oh, ooh, big hit delivered. Ball delivered on the sidelines. Third and five play off the timeout, and McCord delivers a strike. And a first down catch just across the 35. I don't know if Gene Smith, the AD, when they hired him, knew about what that, how much he could bring to the table in that area. Well, he's so smart. And the most significant hire in college football last year. Nice out pattern that is complete. That's Ballard. Again, quick out to Ballard. And McCord will let it fly. And there it is. Wide receiver as well as a quarterback. A little naked bootleg right action, open. and it is wide open to Ballard. Jaden Ballard down the sideline. Oh, nice it is touchdown. Coach, <laughs> I'm thinking about Barry Switzer now. He's had a long day of travel back mm -hmm. from Lincoln, Nebraska, probably watching this right now. Our rules expert in the booth, well acquainted with Tom, as McCord rolls out and makes the completion. And 